It is your boy Randy D and I'm back for more reactions. So guys, if y'all are already seeing this t-shirt I'm wearing, y'all know what movie I watched last night. So basically I won't tell you no spoilers, but uh, there's a bit of a small re reveal I'm gonna give right, right after when I do King Vader's hood Jujutsu Kaisen. Right now, Let's get on to some reactions because we're going to take a look at this video called Rowley Radiates Black Air Force Energy. So guys, y'all already know about the DBZ Broly. But we're going to take a look at this video. The video is by CJ the Champ. The link to the video will be in the description down below. So let's get into it. But then look at this right here. It's a form one. Now you see any other day you see a form one, somebody about to get their ass jumped. But now Broly hit him with that Uno reverse card, bro. He said y'all about to get jumped by me and me alone. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is finally time to return to the round table of Black Air Force activity. And a new challenger is approaching to be judged and to join this council of sacred gods. Now this man is no introduction. And my god, if he makes it, we're gonna need a bigger table because his big ass is gonna take up at least three seats by himself. But yes, it is finally time to welcome the legendary Giga Nigga 9000 himself. Broly! Now, now, we all know Broly's a menace. I mean, even though his original bat story is stupid as fuck. Like, like for real, y'all. The original Broly movie, like, he, he had the stupidest bat story I've ever heard in my life. Thank God they fixed that in a super movie, yo. But no, yeah, we're not here to hear any of that bat story no bullshit. We're here to see this big-ass, tall-ass, 7-Eleven-ass motherfucker host a nigga. So y'all already know I got the evidence on deck. And it is time to see if this man is worthy to be sat at the round table of Black Air Force activity. So without further ado, <clears throat> Exhibit A. Oh, this man beat the hell out of four Super Saiyans and a Namek at the same damn time. I'll tell y'all this. This might be one of the most brutal beatdowns in anime history. Like, this man literally ran everybody's fame. Like, they couldn't even jump him, bro. Look how he just dodges all this shit with no effort, giving zero fucks in the process. Hey, but yo, I ain't gonna lie, though. At the beginning of the movie, I didn't think he was gonna be all that. I mean, when you first see the dude in his base form, I mean, come on, y'all. Just look at his ass, bro. With this long, pencil-ass neck. Motherfucker look like an inbred straight out of Central Alabama. Hey, yo, this bruh. man was high as a kite, bro. Like, this nigga look like he in his own world at the moment. So when I was a kid, I was like, all right, this gonna be some easy work for my boy Goku. Nobody could be Goku, right? <laughs> Oh, it's okay, it's okay, he just getting warmed up. Oh. Oh, God. God damn it, stop! Yeah, this man was running everybody's fade with no effort, bro. But you want to know what Broly's great speed is in my eyes? This man made Vegeta, a member of the round table of Black Air Force activity, a bitch. Yo, my nigga didn't even wanna fight him, bruh. He made Vegeta. Out of all the people, bruh, Vegeta shit bricks. Bruh. Oh my god. Had this nigga on his knees and everything, bruh. Oh my gosh. If you don't get your sorry ass up, nigga, put your ba 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 ba. <laughs> Oh like, my god. Your ass from this goddamn council. Damn, you look at this movie in canon, nigga. Shit, I was gonna have to put up a poll to revoke your Black Air Force energy license, bro. This is goddamn unacceptable. But you know what? I'll let it slide just this once. But if I catch you doing some big shit like this ever again, your ass is getting revoked, nigga. <clears throat> but anyways, I feel bad for these little green people, bro. This man Broly just mirthed they planet for no reason. I mean, this is how this basically went down, bro. Roll the clip. Oh, look at the little green niggas trying to do some rebellious ass shit. I got a question for y'all. Is that your plan right there? Yeah, why? Shit. Nigga, fuck your plan. Oh, shit, what the nigga doing? Oh, shit, my hands. Just kidding. <laughs> look at this bitch. 
vicious ass WWE style clothesline. Like this dude literally picked Trump's ass up off the ground with his arm and slammed his ass in the wall, bro. And I ain't gonna lie though, this man Broly might have had some of the most terrifying quotes in anime history, dog. I mean, just listen to what this man says real quick. Chocolate, how much do you love your son? This man is out here threatening kids, bruh. Kakarot, how much do you love your son? Hell no, bruh. That's how you know Hell you're dealing no. with some of them psychopath ass niggas, dog. Look at him just eat this knee to the jaw, bruh. Dude just ate that shit for breakfast, bruh. And then, oh, poor goat. Oh, oh, oh my god. He came out the woodwork, grabbed his face, and started dragging it on the wall. Like, bruh, chill. The dude's only 11. Yo, this man Broly said these hands are ready to eat for everyone. Oh, my nigga. Then he just comes out of nowhere and just puts up a close lines of what? Oh, oh my god. <laughs> and then he does it again, bro. You know who Broly reminds me of? That one character in a fighting game that just has that one broken ass move that you can just spam oh. over and over and over again. Like, bro, we all know we all have that one friend. That one friend that always plays the OP ass character and just spams that shit. Like, they can be absolute dog water in the game. Like, literal doo doo cheeks. But once they catch your ass slipping once, it's, it's over, bro. You're, 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 you're done. Like, this is literally Broly, bro. He is the embodiment of side B spam. Like, he only needs one move, bro. Stick out your damn arm and just move forward. And yo, this man was just battering Goku, bro. But you know what? I give Goku props, bro. At least he was still fighting him. Not like your bitch ass. Gosh, would you get off your ass up? You see, it sucks when your favorite character gets bitched out like this. But then look at this right here. It's a four-on-one. Now, you see, any other day, you see a four-on-one, somebody about to get their ass jumped. But now, Broly hit him with that Uno reverse card, bro. He said, y'all niggas about to get jumped by me and me alone, bitch. Come on, y'all. Look, look at this. Look at this. The disrespect. His arms are crossed and he is smiling while they're doing this shit. And look at this man Piccolo, bro. He came in trying to attack Broly. Nah, he ended up hurting himself ah, yeah. and trying to attack him, bro. And yo, look at this. This man is moving like a damn freight train. Imagine you are in a dark alley and then you see this shit coming at your ass. Oh, God. Oh, look how he just kicks Piccolo out the way, bro. Kick the shit out of his ass. <laughs> it was like this man Piccolo was just roadkill on the road and Broly just ran his ass over. And here go Vegeta again, looking like a bitch. This man really had to pick his sorry ass up and drag his ass all the way out here, bruh. Oh my gosh, Vegeta, you pressing my motherfucking buttons, my nigga. And you know, bitch, you supposed to be the hardest nigga in the Z Fighters, bruh. And you out here getting caught lacking. Like, this man Piccolo had to give him a whole ass pep talk. And then this man Broly did the most savage thing I've ever seen in my life. He walked through a Kamehameha. Oh my god. Not even a scratch in this nigga is laughing. Look at this man Goku's face, bro. This just says it all. What the fuck is we doing? So Vegeta finally grew up here and decided to attack. Thank god. But we, we all know what was gonna happen. <laughs> At least he tried. That's all I'm gonna say. And then this man killed his pops. He crushed him in that small ass escape pod, then threw his ass to goddamn Narnia. Like he chucked that bitch. Like what is that Olympic sport where like they twirl around and like they chuck the fuck out of that ball? Discus, yeah, 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 discus. He oh, plays discus, discus with his pops as the goddamn ball. Nigga set a galactic record. And then he started jumping on this man like a damn trampoline. Oh my lord, have mercy. Bro, do I even have to go on to Exhibit B? I, I mean, I mean, why not? So yeah, that was Exhibit A. So uh, I guess we'll do Exhibit B. I mean, he don't need it, but we'll do Exhibit B. So, <clears throat> Exhibit B. This man came back from the brink of death to beat the shit out of Goku's kids and his daughter-in-law in a younger version of Trump. Again. Oh my God, this shit gotta stop, bro. Broly, Broly, Broly. I don't know what this man Goku did 
to piss you off so much. I mean, was his crying that damn loud? Like, my nigga, you should have just called a noise complaint or some shit. Like, he pissed him off to the point that the only words that this man can say at this point is Kakarot. And oh my gosh, bro. I felt so bad for Guilty, bro. This is why you should never get the same haircut as your father. And then, oh, poor Trunks as well. Like, this man already oh. beat up his future self. So he said, you know what? I'm gonna beat up your present self now. But Dell also got yes. smarter, but I mean, at least it wasn't as bad as a spoken ass oh. puppet. Oh my ah. gosh. Now, that is one of the most brutal beatdowns in anime history. Hands down. Not then bad. Gohan had to get his ass whooped again. You probably had PTSD after last. That's how he got his face dragged through the hole. Oh my god, like, look at this. He is, like, bending his spine right now. Then he gave him the nastiest bear hug of all time. <laughs> and I love how the only way they could beat this man was the power of plot. <laughs> Yeah, uh, we're gonna need a bigger table. Cause this man has clearly earned his spot on the round table of Black Air Force activity. Like this is savagery on another level. But I am not talking about Bio Broly. That 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 movie was some ass cheeks, I'm sorry. And even yeah. though Super Broly is a way, way, way better written character than Z Broly, Z Broly just had that just savageness. That just ruthless ass aggression like every time you saw this man on the screen you knew somebody was about to get their ass body so yeah uh, broly broly is a menace he made this table with ease we only needed two exhibits so i mean yeah that's basically it i mean if you see anybody running down the street or running down an alley looking like this just do yourself a favor and just cover up your booty cheeks so yeah just gonna go ahead and uh skedaddle but, he, but here's my, my thing. Now, on, on that bro, Broly's second com, coming, why didn't Gohan go Super Saiyan 2? I mean, like, only thing, thing I saw, saw was regular Super Saiyan Gohan, but not Super Saiyan 2 Gohan actually throw, throwing those ha hands at bro, Broly while Super Saiyan 2. Like, to me, that... That's just my question. But man, but that's just lazy writing. But anyway guys, post your comments down below to what y'all think about this video. Make sure to also subscribe to CJ the channel. Make sure to also like, comment, and subscribe to this video. Follow your boy on Twitter and Instagram at Diesel687. Share with your friends. Oh, and CJ the Chimp. I'm not fi finished with these reactions I'm do doing to you. So until then, this is your boy Randy D. And this is Diesel Reactions.